life with the Logans uh, Where everything's we Everything's we We're down and devoted To our friends and family oh, oh, oh. And how we love one another That's right Cause we're gonna be together For life Yo, so I was trying to vlog this earlier before we left the house, but the camera was dead, so it's been sitting in the back seat. Connected. Shout out to Tesla, because you can just charge stuff. I'm gonna fill you guys in, okay? The madness, the chaos? This has been, this has been just madness, madness all right? Madness and chaos? Madness. I mean, at this point, our whole life is madness and chaos. Madness. I'm just going along with, it. it's, it's the vibe. It's madness. This is the vibe of the season. Um. Chaos is the vibe. So. By the time they see this, they already know, so you yeah, so there's been so much going on. You already know she's pregnant. Um, while that has been going on, there's been some more ministerial responsibilities that I've had to take on due to some personal things. Um, keep my dad in your prayers. He's he's okay, but you know, there's just been some health complications, and we're just believing God for full healing. Um, we're believing God for the right doctors and the right people to speak the proper information because the healthcare system is out of control. It is. I've preached by the time you'll see this, I what I've preached Sunday, Wednesday, Sunday. Okay? But today's Wednesday, the seventh. The sixth. Seventh. Seventh. Tomorrow's sure? eighth. Yes, I know. Our flight's tomorrow, tomorrow night. Oh, I preach Bible study tonight, and then tomorrow we're going to New York Fashion Week. At 7 a.m. in the morning. 7 a.m. Oh, our flight's at 8.30. 7, yeah, flight's at 8.30. New York Fashion Week. Vicky's with a new um, management company, and they're already making big moves. So they got her coming out to Fashion Week. She's meeting with some brands. She's meeting with the new team. Uh, and we're about to do a big reveal, which by this time you would have seen. One, two, three, three, two, one. Test complete. Um, so, Vicky ordered a bunch of different things. You know what I'm saying? Her, her, her fashion sense is kind of, it's there, but like it's, it's difficult for her to unlock it at this time. <laughs> difficult because because of the pregnancy brain that has taken over. My brain over. is not normal. This is not me. I'm right? fighting for my life. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I do that to these people? <laughs> it's not me. This is not me. This is not me, man. Normally, I would have been shot. See, here's the thing about me. I stay ready, okay? Normally, I stay ready, so I gotta get ready. So normally, I'm always shopping regardless. Like, I would have been shopped by now. I haven't shopped the entire time I've been pregnant. Like, I have not bought clothing items or accessories or anything. I haven't bought anything since in the past two months, two and a half months. So, like, I have nothing. Like, I don't have anything new for the season. Like, all my clothes, I can't fit. <laughs> Sweatpants are all that fits me right now. I'm just like, oh my God, I need new clothes because I can't fit anything. I mean, it's just wild. So like, I'm just frantically trying to find things. I just found out that I was actually gonna be there long enough to actually do Fashion Week-ish things last week. So I really wasn't even prepared for this. Then I bought Cam's flight last week because I'm like, I need you to go with me because we might as well just announce that we're pregnant while we're there. Since we're going, we might as well. I mean, how else would we do it? I mean, I don't know. I hadn't figured out a plan. My dad's ready to tell people. His dad's ready to tell people. So it's just like, Everybody's pressuring me to tell people and then I'm already showing so like I have to say something because if not as I feel like my face is already giving it away um, She's showing now and I'm and my stomach is showing like so I'm like at this point I don't even feel like hiding it anymore. I might as well say something So I'm like, okay, we're gonna announce that fashion week But the problem is I don't have freaking clothes to wear so I'm like rushing to buy things order things I ordered things last week and then stuff is like delayed so I have to go to Zara today to pick up the stuff that got delayed and then it's just a mess, a hot mess. I have literally one outfit so far <laughs> and we leave tomorrow. So, I mean, by the time y'all see this, I would have already been there and was cute and it, it went well. So good, yay for the future. But right now, this is stressful. Cam only has to get one outfit. So he's really not, 
He's really not worried. But, I mean... I mean, I'm still kind of worried because here's the thing. I don't want... This is this is both of our moment, right? This is going to be is. both of our child. Yes. But I don't want her to be, like, super duper, you know what I'm saying, fashionable, and I'm out here like a bum. Okay. I mean, if push comes to shove, if her, you want to be Her, Lorelco, up, and Wanda already left me in the dust on our Puerto Rico trip. <laughs> and I made a vow. Oh my God. That I would never, ever be left in the dust ever again. My wife had me out here just like Fred Hammond. <laughs> <laughs> Babe, it wasn't that With bad. two-piece monochrome. It wasn't monochromatic that bad. You were giving Miami. Outfit that was. You were giving DJ Khaled Extra Miami. big. And my beard was just super nice that time too. No, you looked fine. You looked fine, baby. It wasn't um, that bad. This is it's fashion week. So yes, I'm gonna be my pants are dressy, so that's why it seems like I'm gonna be dressed up because my pants are That's my what I'm saying, dressy. like But I mean, it's not that big of a deal if you're not super dressed up. You could wear a suit. I mean you could bring a suit jacket. I would not I don't care. I told you you can wear what you want. I'm gonna be wearing a blazer, so however you feel comfortable is however you feel. I just want the I just want the aesthetic to match. I don't want you to be in. I'm just making this up. I don't want you to be in ballroom gear. And I'm not I gonna got be on, in ballroom gear. I just told you. I I just said this is an example. I'm making this up. I mean, my I don't want you to be in ballroom gear. And I got on like street style. Like I got on a warm up, <laughs> a basketball warm up with some, you know, like. I mean, okay, well. You know what I'm wearing? I'm wearing some dress pants with the belly cut out. So, I mean, if you want to wear something a little more dressy to match me, I mean, hey, do you, boo? I just, you know, I figured you would want to be a little casual. I mean, you can be casual and still wear, you know, something. That just said you're going to do your blazer situation. I could be. I don't know. I, mean, I may have one more stop after I drop you off. Is Lexus picking you up? Yeah. Yeah, because I gotta go get my pants. Gotta go pick them up from Ferha. Shout out to Ferha for doing my pants overnight for me. This is just chaos. It's chaos. Yeah, I, I don't. It's chaos. Depending right? on when we take the pick. Yeah, I don't. I don't it's think chaos it. now. No, it's chaos. I feel like we're only gonna post the picture on Friday because you haven't even edited the vlog with me the podcast yet. But I want to watch it. I can it. edit that on the plane. I know, but I want to watch it back before. <laughs> before you upload it. You can watch it back. It. I'll be done. Yo. You want to tell me? I guess I can do it. But, I mean, we have you, time. You, you, you got to go to sleep. We do have time. I, we don't have much to do other than. But that's the thing. I'm like, dang, should I bring extra outfits? Because I don't know what's going on at night. Like, what if I get invited to dinner or something? What am I going to wear? I'm not ready. My first one point in fashion week and I'm taking a baby with me and I don't know what I'm wearing. It's the first time in my life I've never known what I'm gonna wear. I mean normally I don't know what I'm gonna wear, but like I can pull it together because I have things. You know what I'm saying? Back when I was skinny, I had things. I'm literally taking a child with me. This is just so just surreal. I don't even know what I'm doing. Can you get from behind this? Man? I want to. I was set I was, I hate being in the right lane though. It's too close to the wall. It stresses me. I don't like stuff on the right. I'd rather be stressed by this than being behind that. I, we were talking about finding a destination the other day. I didn't see too many, okay. too many random. Okay. And when we drove from Dallas to, I mean, from Austin to Dallas, that dude that had he, hardwood yeah, that, that flew happen. off the back, like. Oh, Man. and then that's the other thing. We go to okay, so we go to New York tomorrow. We get back Saturday night. Can't I, preach it Sunday. Sunday. We're only here for a few days. And then we gotta go back to Dallas, not Dallas. We gotta go back to Texas. We're going to Austin for Taylor and Raven's birthday parties. So then there's another trip. And then we'll be done. We'll be done until I wanna go on a on a baby moon. It'll be our last trip to Lincoln. It'll be our last baby list trip together. <sighs> what is happening? She's so excited. So many changes. Uh, It'll be our last trip. Baby not, list. Not having had a baby. Baby list. Our last trip. We will go on many baby. trips without our child. I know, but I'm saying like we'll have a baby to worry about. 
we have to think about, oh, there's a baby right. at my house. See, I don't like this. I'm sandwiched. I don't like this. You can control. Let's see, wake up. So yeah, all that's going on. A lot of stuff going on. Now we're zooming. Well, not really. She had two minutes. We're no, getting, we're good on time. We're, we're taking her to her lash appointment. I get my hair cut at 2.30. I gotta pick up my pants at 2.30. She gotta pick up her pants at 2.30. I get my haircut at 2.30. Then I gotta go home, uh, send uh, my message off to the video team so they can have the notes loaded and scriptures loaded. Can I finish? I just gotta put everything in. I already know what I'm gonna, like, it's in my head. I literally only use notes now for the video team. I don't really need them anymore. But yeah, so. That's what we got going on. We were literally running through the mall. Oh we went gosh. to the best mall that we could to find the best stuff that we could possibly find so we wouldn't have to go to the city or something because that was going to take more time. I know, but man, the city would have been great. Man, I the probably, city, man. I probably would have found stuff. The, down, the downtown Nordstrom would have had, they had everything. What, I, what I needed. They would have had everything. They would have had what I needed. Even though I was able to, well, we could have went to downtown. I want to see sunglasses. Too. Same. I wanted to. <laughs> we could still shop when we get there. We have Thursday night, and we you do. know stuff doesn't close. We do. So technically, we could. We do. We could shop in, in short. It's just I wanted to have my stuff ready to go and not think about it. It also doesn't help that I can't spend as much money as I want to. So <laughs> I'm trying to be frugal. So I'm like, man, I really want some new Gucci shades, but it's fine. I don't need Gucci shades. I'll just, I'll just wear shades that I already have. It's fine. I have things. I just don't want to wear them because I've worn them out already. Like, I wear my stuff. One thing about me, especially if I'm spending some money on something, I'm going to wear my stuff, okay? And I'm going to wear it out. You're going to see it a million times. So now I feel like I've worn everything a million times and I can't really wear the stuff that I have already. It's fine. I'm gonna make it work. There are things that I can wear, possibly maybe that can stretch. So yeah, that's what we got going on, and we'll check back in later. All right, gang. It's been several hours, so I went and got my hair cut. As you can see, fresh new cut. You know, little beard enhancement. It is what it is. You got a lace front. <laughs> Mind your business. There was a nail in my tire right after I dropped Vicky off to get her lashes done. I went to grab a bite to eat, came back home, finished my message, sent it off to video team, uh, got to church, taught the word. We were hungry because I hadn't eaten since like lunchtime. And after church, now it's like 8.30, we're on our way home. My brother Manny FaceTimed me. Me and Manny FaceTimed for like an hour and some change. Um, and now me and Vicky are back to packing, ensuring that we have what we need to get prepared for New York Fashion Week. So I just grabbed her little boots out the back of the car. She just let me know that she's naked, so she won't be on cam, but yeah, so we're packing. It's chaos, but yeah, you know. Just go with, just roll with the punches. Lex is picking us up at like six, dark 30 in the morning. Um, yeah, so. See y'all in the morning. Action because we are 
definitely in New York. It's not that bad. No, it's not. It's not that. I mean, but this. It's giving O'Hare. This wing is a lot better. Oh, it is. Now. I wonder if they fixed LAX. Where LAX still trash. But yeah, they they made some nice improvements to the concourse we came out of in Delta. Marble walls and the bathrooms really nice and clean. And good job. So headed to. Hotel. Well, we probably won't be able to check in yet. We can put our stuff in there. Yeah. Um, I can make up our class. I don't have to be at the thing until 1. So I have about 15 minutes or so to fix up. And then walk over to the Amazon thing. I don't need to change clothes or anything, so that's good. Because it's just like a styling event. So they're Oh, they're gonna start clothes and stuff. I mean, well, I get to pick out and stuff and use my Amazon storefront to promote it or whatever. So that's cool. Dope. And then that's over at three. And then after that, we're free for the day. Cool. to the hotel -y. to the telly public walking to the jungle welcome to the jungle na, 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 na. Yeah, yeah. that was actually pretty good <laughs> that's actually pretty good oh, this is situated and check back. Got a pool table? It's lit. I'm taking anybody money. Alright, we in the lounge area waiting for our room. And Mrs. Logan is getting her makeup together. A quick beat. A beat on the go? Beats to go? What? Beats to go? I mean, look at it. Got the room here set up. I mean, the ambiance surrounding it. Beats to go? She's killing it, okay? <laughs> all that's going on. Going the quick beat. All that's going on. The quick beat is all we needed. The quick beat is all that was needed. Look at her. Look at her go. I had time to curl my baby hair. Just let me uh, lick my finger and twirl my... <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Right. We have the talent. We have the talent here. About the to head up to the talent the Amazon mm -hmm. event. We're not here yet. Where right. are you going? The talent is here. This looks kind of cool. This, like that little gradient that's on the. That's coming from there. But it's like lights but then it's also mirrored it's kind of dope ain't gonna cap and at this point this hoodie is getting warm because of the walk but we will press on hello 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 i know it's a little jarring when you're like in the dark elevator and yes. you're like did i just reach the gates of heaven or <laughs> where am i welcome i'm here again thank you Hi. I'm Merrick from the Drone. Hi, nice to meet you. This Hi, is I'm Sophia. Sophia. Yeah, nice to meet you. Bailey's actually on her way, so hopefully she'll catch you. Okay, cool. Yes. Awesome. Yes. I love her. Hello. 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 Hello.
have you here. Thank you. Photos or sweater? I think it's like a photo shoot. Yeah. yeah. It's like, yeah. like, and then you get the air photos to airdrop to you too right away. Like there's no wait. Uh huh. We love technology. <laughs> <laughs> like four or five pieces. So like you know, like you do sunglasses, accessories, jacket, blazer, kind of whatever how you want to mix and match. And then once you know what you want, I can take photos of everything, and then we'll have someone bring it on. Okay. Yeah, I know. Then you don't like really care. Shop in store, oh, that regular was a store. Free one. Up there playing soccer, I would be up there moving. Like a, it looks like a suit. Yeah. Okay. We are out here at the Amazon Influencers event. Okay. Probably can't see that because it's like white. But this is that. We're at the styling suite, which is basically like a styling event where they have all of these clothes and shoes and stuff from the uh, Amazon um, Staples by the Drop collection. So I am kind of just like browsing around, shopping around, looking for things. I picked some stuff out so that I could put it on and then take some pics. They have a really cute like little uh, photo booth set up, which is cool. So I'm waiting for my stuff to come up. They went and ordered it from downstairs and they're bringing it up for me so yeah that's what we're doing this is actually really cool it's my first time at fashion week so yeah happy to be here i mean i mean we won't be here like super super long we're only going to be here for three days trying to soak in all the vibes and then get on out because cam gotta preach on sunday excited i don't i'm not really super excited because my fits don't hit like i want them to hit you know what i'm saying i really couldn't put together much in a week but I did bet I did my best. Um, so yeah, waiting on my clothes to come up. I really want them to come back around with some more food because I'm hungry. I have not eaten since breakfast this morning, and that was at seven o'clock. So I'm definitely hungry. So hopefully we can you know get these pics, wrap this up, so I can head on to get to eat. Yeah, girl, I'm hungry. Okay, the girl and the kid. Get in there. Do I look like I'm showing? Not really. Not right now. On the phone, you didn't. Okay. And then the angle I had it, like, you looked. I want some more food. Uh, it took them yeah. an hour to bring out her clothes. This is not her complaining, so if Amazon try to get mad, this is me complaining. <laughs> I mean, and now they're done. They're packing everything up. She, she was going to get a nice little shot. Yeah, We've been here since like 1.15, it's now 3.06, and they're packing up. If, if you're not taking a picture with Amazon, I, I wouldn't put the shoe on. Well, it's fine. I don't want you guys to meet now. But we have light. The set is still there. All right. All right, Amazon event is done, finito, finished. And uh, now 
are about to go check into the hotel. Yes. And then feed her, and then. But I'm not. Well, I am. Yeah, I want to eat. I'm not like starving anymore. Yeah. But I do want to eat. Feed. How do we get back up? I hit. I hit two. I we did. Yeah, I hit two. Hit the lobby. Quickly, please. Okay. That is insane. I definitely thought we were going down. That's so funny. Wow. Well, we're Here back we up. Let's so. Um. <laughs> All right. Finally made it out. And uh, now it's time to head back and then get some grub. See if we can remember how to go back. We're in New York. Concrete jungle where dreams are made of. Do you want to carry this bag? Lights will inspire you. Now we're in New York. Do you feel inspired? No. <laughs> well, I can't vlog in hold the bag. My, my okay. shoulder tired. I wish I would have known that. There was a Fenty event going on. At three, I would have left early to get to the Fenty event. But I would have needed to not have makeup on, which actually would have been a little bit better because I wouldn't have had to do my makeup. But it's fine. Because I didn't need I wanted to go to the Amazon thing so I could meet the Amazon drop team, which I did. Because normally I'm just on calls with them, you know? So I get to see their faces on Zoom. But I never really like met them in person, so it was cool to meet everybody in person. That's always nice. Got to meet the drop team. They're excited about the um, the next drop. Can I say that? When do I? I don't even know when I announce the next drop. Vicky, take this out if I haven't announced it yet. <laughs> the time. only thing, it's not that we have to look at it. Did we turn here? Keep straight. But wait. On Bowery? Keep straight. Oh, we're on Bowery. You're right. Yeah, I I don't know. What was I finna say? I don't remember. I don't remember what I was saying, but. You don't know if you can announce it yet. Oh yeah, I don't know if I can say it yet because I haven't announced it yet. Just a lot of announcements happening at once. So by the time y'all see me talking about this, you'll know. <laughs> if not, you won't hear any of this. So, all right, I don't know what I want to eat. I kind of don't care. So I'm gonna let you make the executive decision. So yeah, we'll decide we're gonna eat. We're gonna get back to y'all when we get back to y'all. Molly checked in. Floor 10. Room is high. I knew it was going to be something. I feel like I get the same view every time. <laughs> every time I come to New York, I just get the side of a building view. Okay. cook all of y'all. The sounds of a basketball is his mating call. I will cook, cook all of y'all. I got, I brought some workout gear now. I will hoop y'all in these, in these pot stickers. It's the other way. All right, we're going the other way. <laughs> no stuff dripping again. You know, it's New York. Don't dumpster. 
That's New York for you. Dropping the trash off. Yeah, just drop it on the side of the street. I hate masks, but I want a mask. I want a mask because it smells like who did it and why. That's a nice little. Oh, that like must it. be the condos of the condos of public. I'm not gonna be in this vlog at all, am I? <laughs> oh, it's another some more courts over here. Huh? Some more courts over. Oh, they running too. You don't have to put it on. Put it on both of us. They running too. They got really run. Your arm tired? Oh, uh, he airballed. Yep. Soho Deli. I can't see from this angle, so like I can't. I can only see you. I, if I use your other arm, I you have to. two arms. You gotta keep one arm on lock. Oh my goodness! Just in case, just in case you gotta fight. You just look like you're struggling. Here. <laughs> you look like he was struggling. I'm trying to help you out. See. The line at the pizza joint. It's the line. It must be bussing, as Norris would say. It must be bussing if the line is long. I wonder where my back is. Right? They got all the favorite pieces on the wall. That's it. Ryan. Ryan Seat. Ryan Seat. Uh, pepperoni slice and margarita. Pepperoni, margarita, anything else? You want something to drink? You better ask him, right? You're just saying it now. Right here, ice is. Come on, y'all. They in here. Alright. Prince Street Pizza was good. It was a hit. Thoughts? Excellent. <laughs> that red no sauce that they use. The it's, red it's sauce. Got little, it's got a little spice to it, you know? It's got a little oh, your pepperoni? See, my red sauce had yeah, like sauce. Yeah. Sauce. had like a richness. It was kind of sweet. I liked it. It was good. So now we're at this. We're at the Little Cupcake Bake Shop. Because one of the ladies that was in front of us said is they got really good cake and homemade ice cream, so you know your boy had to come try it out. They say you guys have German chocolate cake? Let me do a... Let me do a, a brownie. I want to try the red velvet, the red velvet. Is anything else? Is anyone else ready? That's it. I, let me I, let me stop. So I got the German, the, the broth. They got real banana pudding, and then they got banana pudding ice cream. They are going crazy. I Oatmeal butterscotch? Oh my god. I feel like they ain't never had nothing before. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All this looks good. That's, that's chocolate cake in the U.S. Yeah. First time here? Uh, first time in, in uh, uh, here, back? yes. You need a bag? No, we're about to eat no. it here. Let's get them out. Treat you guys to a uh, seven layer. Try that. Seven layer. Yeah, layer. Oh, thank okay. you. Thank you. It's, it's an almond based cake with raspberry and chocolate and donuts. Have you ever had like a seven layer kind of cookie? Yes. This is a cupcake form. Okay. Man. Oh, wow. Thank you. Thank you so much. We're about to have this seven layer. I love Chicago. It's beautiful. Summertime shot. I say it's the best. Thank you. Enjoy, guys. Thank you. Enjoy. Oh, I'm about to. I'm about to enjoy. I'm already knowing. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Seven layer cupcake, right? You already said. And then. Vicky's brownie plus upside down. They look good on the upside. Banana pudding ice cream? Get out of here. I'm about to dig. We'll check back in later. Alright, we're on our way to Kith. You want some hiking gear? I got invited to a hike. You got invited to a hike here? Yes, hiking with rappers. With who? With rappers. Rappers. With rappers? With rappers. That is so funny. She got invited to a hiking event for Fashion hiking Week. Hiking with rappers. 
with Timberland. Uh, hiking with rappers. So it's probably legit rappers because it's with Timberland. Absolutely hilarious. Thinking we I doing. I invited to a lot of stuff. I just am old. Freestyling on your way. I just want to eat. I'm here to get off my two little fits and <laughs> eat and go home. Back in the day, I, I would I would run around to all the events and do all the things, but. Um, and meet the team. You're meeting the team. Right. Like got a little walk. Oh, I smell like piss. We got a little walk. Check in as soon as we get to Kith. Kith. I was looking for the fair guy at California's. They didn't have them. A nice selection of shoes and stuff, though. Nice location. Nice area. This didn't have what I'm looking for. Alright, guys. We're, we chilled in the room for a sec, but now we're about to go. Back and you like the lips, yeah. to Kiss. I do like the lips a lot. It feels it's like very about to go back to Kiss. They have that in Matt and I like so that. Yeah. we're about to cop, pop some shoes, and then I'm probably about to get some New Balances. Yeah, I want some shoes. I need some comfortable sneakers. You low key, you low key do need some comfy shoes. Oh, wow, like, why you brought them? Chuck well, Taylors are not cute. comfortable. I was They're trying to be cute and fashionable. I wanted to wear boots, but I couldn't because I knew my feet was going to hurt. Lo and behold, what I chose wasn't any better. I mean, a little bit. They weren't as heavy. At least they weren't heavy. They were heavy. My ankles and my legs would be like so tired right now. This hotel smells like Santal and I'm mad that I left. I literally just bought some Santal. Bet you they use Romatech. They do. They have to. This is really a time work, time work haul. Like, if you do it real fast, Turn the shutter speed down or up. Can't remember. Yeah. Right. This is Vicky swag right here. You have to tell people when you like things. Let's see if we can remember how to get there. We, we're walking by faith right now. The guy's still hooping over here. He's got my new balances on. I love those. He was smiling and stuff at me. New Yorkers are alright with me. You know? They are alright with me. I ain't, I ain't mad at you. One thing I love about New York people is they're they're very straightforward <laughs> and they're honest. Like they gonna say what they feel. They're not gonna sugarcoat it. You know what I mean? They're straightforward with it. They don't be playing no games. They say what they say and they mean it. Loafers. Now you're gonna you're gonna notice now. You're gonna notice every time you see somebody, they're gonna have loafers on with socks. Yeah. Now I'm gonna go home and wear loafers all the time. See? Yeah, that's crazy. Vicky literally said she literally said this when we was in the room. She she understands that there is a for each geographical location. Every major city. Every major geographical location, major city. There is a complementary. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> there is a complementary aesthetic that goes along with that geographical location. And she said it in the room, what this geographical location's aesthetic is. And we walked outside shortly thereafter. She was correct. I just, I noticed things. I'm, I'm a fashion girl, so I noticed things. And I noticed that every city, every major city has its own style. Cause I always see the girls in Chicago, they have on, you know, similar things when they go out. They always wear the similar, similar style. So here, I, was, I noticed when I got here, everybody has on loafers. And I was like, loafers is their thing. Like, all the girls here wear little penny loafers or chunky loafers or whatever. And I thought about that because I wanted to wear my loafers because I have some Prada loafers that I got on consignment and I love them. But my foot is already swelling. So I can't fit them right now, which is depressing because I bought them a half size bigger just so they would fit and they still don't fit. The thing about Italian shoes I is just, they're always gonna be super skinny anyway. Um, designer shoes in general typically are gonna be small. They be, they be narrow and long. They be narrow and long, yes. Cause like, my, cause my fear of God, he, he has his shoes sourced from Italy yeah. and they be narrow and long. They're always like, narrow. Even if I size down, they still be French, light. French shoes are like that too cause Louboutins were, are very narrow. Yeah. Any, any like, most of the time designer shoes be super narrow, so I always get like a size up. But man, I'm gonna have to go two sizes up now. 
I probably can't even fit my Prada boots. I ain't even tried to put them on. Yeah. But I probably won't be able to wear them. And I'm sad about it. Because they was kind of tight before. Because those are my true size. They fit, but they're tight. So, yeah. This is what this is what this is doing to me. <laughs> I already knew my foot was gonna go up a size. I knew that before I got pregnant. I was like, I know my foot's gonna go up a size. And it already is, and I'm frustrated. It's hard for me to fit things. Very sad about it. Is this the, uh... Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. You have me power walking out here. I know. You gotta you know keep up. You gotta keep up. You know I'm not built for this. Don't help this, you got. Well, because my feet Flip hurt. on. It's the most I done walked in three weeks. Okay, the gowns. Okay. Okay. Listen, that's a Wanda number right there. Look at that. I'm gonna try one on. It's a Fritz Grace. But all right, we'll check back in in a second. <laughs> at dinner in Soho. We are at Fish Cheeks. There's no sign, but it's the restaurant. Um, we're sitting outside. We're literally on the cobblestone outside. Um, sitting in the middle of the street, basically. Um, I feel like, I don't know if it's always been like this here, but I know in Chicago, they did a lot of restaurants like this, where people eat basically in the middle of the street because of COVID, and so everybody had to sit outside. I like. I mean, I like the vibe of sitting in the street. It's kind of fun, you know? I'm on Cam's hoodie, because I didn't feel like wearing my clothes that I had on earlier. I mean, it's very warm and cozy, so I'm very happy with my decision. <laughs> I already told him when he bought his sweats, I was like, I'm just letting you know right now. I'm wearing your sweats. Your sweats are mine. Just letting you know. But yeah, we're in Soho. Um, I actually think we're gonna come back to this exact street tomorrow. We're taking our um, reveal pics, our baby reveal pics tomorrow. Um, at this point, I keep running into followers and stuff, so I'm just like, we gotta, we gotta go ahead and announce this so that I can just live my life freely and not feel like I have to hide. Cause I definitely be waddling around like a penguin. So, <laughs> even though I'm not even that big, but I'm really tired because we've been traveling all day. I've been up since, I only had like two hours of sleep basically. Cause we went to bed at 1.30, woke up, not two. A good, a good solid four hours of sleep. We went to bed at 1.30, I woke up at 5.30. Um, my alarm started going off and I started having an apocalyptic anytime anytime I be having dreams and like it takes an apocalyptic turn when my alarm starts going off because I hear my phone buzzing and then it's like something's wrong and it's my alarm <laughs> so it's like I forgot I think we were in a hotel room or something I looked out the window and it was like New York was on fire there were helicopters everywhere it was like robots everywhere like taking over and people were and there was like alerts going off and stuff and then i woke up and it was my alarm going off so funny so i've been up since 5 30 this morning and it's currently 8 48 here 7 48 at home so i'm i'm gonna be pooped i'm gonna go to the room and go straight to sleep take a shower go straight to sleep so, oh, spicy mango cocktail for you. And we're trying to cheeky green. Now, in the moment that this cocktail or mocktail isn't working for you, just talk to me. I can always make like a Thai iced tea or something like that. I'll instead. try it right now. I like it. That's it's nice. good. Very nice to hear. Love, Love it. Cheers. Thank you. Of course. That's good. That tastes like this. Takes, he made me. He made me a mocktail. I forget. I literally just forgot what it's called. And he just said it. I'm curious. Was there a it's like lemongrass, <laughs> basil, <laughs> mint, and like club soda. It's got a little bit of lime in there. It tastes just like the drinks that they make for us in the mocktails that they made for us in Dubai. Because Dubai, there was a lot of um, like restaurants and stuff that weren't selling alcohol during the day, so they gave us a lot of mocktails and they were always fresh and they always had mint in them that tastes that tastes just like that super good very good yes sure 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 understood i got you i'm glad that uh, by the time Cam you wind it down thinking. you found some stuff that you really enjoyed that. he's processing i see it the lord is downloading things into his spirit 
Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I don't narrate it, yeah, narrate yeah, yeah. enough on here anyway anymore. Yeah, okay, you took a few I, lately, I have been okay, out of my element. I mean, y'all can probably tell. I've been like that for okay, a yeah. couple years, honestly. Exactly where, where but it's really more so now because my hormones are coming. I'm kind of getting back, trying to get back to myself. Yeah. But I still feel very off. Even planning for this trip, I was like over it, done. Like, I don't want to do this, I don't want to go. And it's not because I don't want to be here. I'm very, very like, grateful to be here and I'm very excited to be here. But at the same time, I'm like, my brain just can't. It can't. It's like having a hard time being creative. Just because we can't taste Now that we got that extra, I can't taste it. I can't. We got the coconut curry right here. Rice, rice, and that's the fish. I forgot what it's called. I literally forgot what it's called. Tile pad. Tile pad chop. Tile fish. Tile fish pad chop. Yeah. And then we're waiting on our crab fried rice, but so far this looks great. Baby, <laughs> if you like spicy stuff, that is very, very spicy. Ooh. My eyes are watering. <coughs> they probably should make that a little less spicy. It is good, but it's too spicy. But it's good though. Ooh. You like the fish? Mm -hmm. Is this your first time having a uh, Thai iced tea? Yes. <laughs> It's Where like, have I been? I don't know. Oh my Thai is goodness. Good. Y'all, this was probably this was probably the best Thai food I've had in a long time. It's really, Jesus. really good. This is on my list of places that I would highly recommend and come back to every time I come to the city. For sure. This was really, really good. So good. We just ate some amazing food at Fish Cheeks. Cheeks. <laughs> Fish cheeks. Fish oh, that's funny. We went to Kith, got some shoes for my father in law, Pops, and then I got some uh, pants, slacks, cargoes to wear tomorrow. I'm very happy with my hotel decision because we are like literally 10 so minutes. Close to everything. Every, everything we do is 10 minutes away. So that's what I wanted. We in the mix. About to go back to the room, relax. Uh, study a little bit and then um, edit the podcast. Oh, you can do all that? Yeah. Edit the pod. I told you, if you don't upload the podcast tomorrow, I won't be mad. You can wait on the podcast if you don't finish. Oh, babe, we said we was going to upload it, so we upload it. Well, I'm also not confident. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> you know, when I'm watching back in picture, I like it and it's just a different podcast. This is not normal. So it's not normal circumstances. Normally I don't care, but now I'm like, well, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> if you're going to post the pictures. I know, but it's different if you're just posting a picture than if you're saying things, like talking about it. I don't know why. It just is. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You can edit it. You can, you can still edit it. You can still edit I'm going to edit it. And I'll watch I'm it. A, I'm going to let her watch. You know what you were saying? Anyway. <laughs> I know, it just... Ugh. 60 seconds left. Service. Heading back to the hotel. Peace. Peace.